What's going on YouTube? So today we've got a different sort of, not really a different video, but a different style of video. We're doing some more pack openings, really, but we're doing them on the TCG Online game. Um, now, I'm going to start to say this right now. If my video is slightly behind of what I'm saying, I am sorry. From what I, from what, from the technology that I have and what I have available to me, this is how it's going to go for right now, I guess, until I can figure something different out. But I just wanted to get this out to you guys because I've been saving these packs for a decent bit, really. And um, yeah, we're just going to jump right into it. So we got 20, we have at least 100 packs. I, I think I said that, at least 100 packs. But we got 21 Sword and Shield series, 10 Hidden Fade, we got 10 Hidden, 10, 21 Sword, 21 Champions Path, 10 Hidden Fates, uh, 31 Sun and Moon Base, 18 Cosmic Eclipse, uh, 1 Burning Shadows, 1 Crimson Invasion, 1 Darkness Ablaze, 1 Sword and Shield, um, a 6 pack Vivid Voltage, a bunch of other Vivid Voltage, and Evolutions, uh, Phantom Forces, just for the heck of it, I bought. I think I bought that one. No, I must not have. Um, so, and oh, Unified Minds, I know about that one. So, what I did is I saved up like 3,000 some coins just from playing Versus. And I, I'm like, I want to open these packs because I, I want to get cards and I want to work the trade market and trade for more packs, trade for different cards and things. But then after I bought the packs, I'm like, oh, wait, you can't trade packs you bought on the game. You have to use ones you got in real life. But luckily, I was able to trade for these other packs with cards I already had. So it was like, I was able to do it. I just had to save the packs and I just wanted to make this video out for you guys. But that's see I, I bought cosmic clips for the sole purpose of me pulling an ADP and went into trade for the ADP I pulled because it's worth a ton on the trade market right but hopefully I do pull more because I have I do have two of them that I can work with trading on so if I could pull and pull one pull a third one and just use the one I can't use the ones that I can't trade in my decks and just trade away you know what I mean um, so we're just gonna jump right into this so I I think I don't know what I want to open first really I think I might just want to knock out these individual ones first so I think I got everything marked for trade that I am able to trade. So if I get something good out of it and I want to trade it, I'll be able to just trade it right away. Um, so I'm just going to open this six card pack and we're going to see what we can get. Now hopefully the audio is good too because I did some testing and I, I think it's going to be all right. But we got Steel Energy, Pick a Peck, Ninkata, and then Coding and Arcuda, and then for the reveal card, a rare Lucario. So that's cool. Okay. That's fine with me. I really don't care honestly what I get on here. I just hope to god like this is my luck with these things i will pull a good card like that's money okay right as i i, I keep look i don't know why i do this but like i keep looking over at my second screen because that's where like my stream labs is open i'm recording to the stream labs and i'll be biased to play but i'll pull a good card right that's worth money in real life and on the game and it's like worthless on the game like this is i'd rather i want the card in real life so i can sell it and get money back or whatever but so far, nothing out of that first pack. We're gonna get, I know I did, the one card, I did pull the Charizard out of the evolutions. I pulled the hollow Charizard. I'm like, is, is, is that is that is that for real? Like, did I just do that? But one thing I did notice too, is if you get, I know this is just me, but if I get a crappy pack in real life, the code is good, if that makes sense. So we we'll reveal one card, it's a reverse Starmie. Here comes Rocket Trainer. And Needle King Hollow. See, I don't know if that's worth anything in real life. But it's a hollow card out of Evolution, so I would assume it might be. I have to check. I'll probably forget to check, but... I know my last video, if you guys didn't see the last video, the last pack opening, it was insane. Okay, you just have to check it out. I don't want to spoil it, but it was an insane pack opening. I was actually... I didn't get what I wanted, but I got, I got some decent things. So, let's just hope this is the same thing. Yeah, this, uh, this X and Y Phantom Forces. I don't even know what's like in this pack. I think I just traded for this pack because it was something I could trade for. Um, we got a Hollow Venomoth. It's probably not worth much in real life anyway. And these cards look so old. I guess they are old because they're from X and Y. Frillish. Scrum Ward, but LP. I see, I was up at LP. Uh, it was an X and Y because I did watch this in the anime. It was an X and Y. Fletchender is actually really. I, I do like Fletchling. Fletchender and. What's the last one? Helen Flame. I think that is a pretty. I think I think that's my favorite bird Pokemon, right behind Star Raptor, right behind the Star Starly set. Okay, so next, I think I'm gonna keep going with the individual ones. So we're gonna open the Darkest of Blaze. Let's hope I don't get the Charizard out of this. So I'm pretty sure there's a Charizard in here, right? 
can't remember. I know there's a Hound Doom in here that I love, and I have it in the game because I traded for it. But if I pull another one, that'd be awesome. Nope, Duck Caddy. Reverse Ferret. Reverse Ferret. If I Bravo, Duck Caddy, Snubble, Bond Sweet, Avatar. You think these cards are all new? Okay, for me at least. Nothing super useful. I know there's only a select few cards on here that I really actually want. Um, mostly just to build up. My eighty, my Arcus Delta Pocket, which is a freaking meta, and I, like I, it baffles me, right? For, for what Pokemon is, that's the first card that I have seen. One of the few couple cards that I have seen, that begs the question: Does Pokemon need a limited forbidden list like how Yu-Gi-Oh has? Because I've come from Yu-Gi-Oh, and I'm coming to Pokemon, and I. I, I, I feel like ADP creates the argument that a limited list needs to be made. Now, I guess it could, like, the argument also is with, like, there's a different, um, I don't know what you want to call them. Like, there's standard, expanded, limited, all that stuff. I mean, you probably could limit it in one thing, but, and I don't even think there is a limited list for Pokemon. For Pokemon. I tried looking one up, and there was, like, nothing. Like, I couldn't find anything. So I, I just assume that no card, I guess it's just, like, I think it's just like you can only use cards from certain from different sets, but I I really do feel like ADP begs the question for do we need a limited list for Pokemon? Just because how how many people are using it? how I don't want to say strong, but like how strong it is. I don't know, but it's 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 highly it's highly available. So it's just like that doesn't like I mean if everyone has access to it really easily then. I guess you really don't need to put limited on it because there's no point in having it highly access. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I just I, I feel like that it brings up the argument that you do need a some sort of limited list for Pokemon. I, I mean, if there is one, I just don't know of it. But I don't even know what we just opened. Cosmic Eclipse, I think. We got a. Uh, it'd be cool to see if I could get all these cards, all the um, the doll versions. I think those are the, the knitted versions of of them. Reverse Aquan, uh, Ar Arquanid, and then we got a another a, a regular Ar Arquanid. Dang. All right, we're just still recording. Yep. Okay. What should we open next? Sword and Shield. Series. We got twenty-two Vivid Voltage. Crimson, no, that's the conservation. And I don't. I don't know if I'm gonna be going too fast for these. I don't want to go too fast for them because then the video's gonna be really short. Which I don't know for you guys. It doesn't matter for you guys, but. I like to I like to kind of have decent long videos, personally. I don't know. But what else? We're we gonna get the sword of shield. I think I think I think Zashings are in this. So if I pull a Zashing, I I think that'd be pretty good. So we got Poke Kid. I, I thought I had a Poke Kid. Ball Toys new, Coupons new. I used the other one. What was that one? Women's a Cot. So far, nothing decent. Like I, I, that's a good thing. I I I don't want to say it's a good thing, cause. Um, but I'm I'm just glad I'm not getting cards that are expensive in the game that I'm like why can't I have gotten that in real life but Krabby Salazile reveal card Hollow Gengar I do have that card in real life I think I have two of them actually I do think I have two of them Solvable Metal Energy done okay so we're gonna go to Unified Minds now can we you know, I was just gonna say, you gotta check out this video too. I, it's, oh man, I don't know how to put it. I called. Um, with, with I, you just gotta see my reaction to it. Whenever I, I called, I'm like, can I get the Mewtwo Mew card out of a Mewtwo Mew pack? And lo and behold, I got a, the full art Mewtwo Mew out of the Mewtwo Mew pack. I was hype. Oh my! Did did I sell that for 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 a piece of cardboard? I sold that. I sold that for a pretty nice chunk of money pretty nice chunk of change but I think I don't know if it's going down I, I sold it because it looked like it was going down in price so I still got decent amount for it but I don't know sometimes I sell a card I'm like should I have waited should I have held on to it we got executor I do I still need that card in real life I still need a freaking executor because what I'm trying to do is I have like four binders four or five binders and they're all organized to fit the national pokedex so like my first one let me just get my glasses here um my first one it's my favorite cards in the front and then 
the back is Gen 1. Um, all in order. And then the second binder, it's Gen 2 and 3, and then um, 3 and 4, no, 4 and 5, yeah, Gen 1, Gen 2 and 3, then 4 and 5, and then the last one's the last generations, because there's not very, very many Pokemon in the last generations. Um, so I, 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 I do have the Kanto region like, done. Like, it's almost done. There's few holes left, and Executor's on the holes. Alright, Crimson, Crimson Invasion. My phone is blowing up. So you can I think it's just a good chat between my girlfriend, me and my sister. Alright, we go card. Gyarados GX, let's go. We got a, we did get a water card. I do want to make a water deck in this. This is the one... See, I, what, I, what I like to do is I like to build decks in this and experiment with them, and if they're good, I'll buy them in real life. Or, or take my real life cards and try to make a deck. But to see I got a water GX is good because I have the uh, Piplup Blastoise that I want to build around. So this helps. If I run one of these in a Magikarp, I think I'd be okay. I mean, it's, it's the only problem with... I, I don't know if it's just my deck building Pokemon sucks, it's but just to my knowledge, like I try building a deck that's not fire and I have I struggle with getting energy on it. Like I fire is so aggressive, like with the welders and everything, and so I love it. Alright, we're into some vivid, vivid voltage. We got reverse Rylu. Can we get a Thikachu? As much as I don't want to pull a Thikachu, but can we get a Thikachu? Okay. Women's God, I hate I hate playing against this card. For whatever for whatever reason. Like I, I Discard all these freaking tool cards and you just one shot everything I freaking own. And it. We got Nessus. That's good. We do need this. Um, for water. Let's see. We still put a bit of voltage. I'm excited. I, I, I'm not going to lie to you. I am ec ecstatic to go in these Sinned Fate packs. I. Part of me. At the, I, I discussed in my last video how I'm like. I told the story of when I went about that Champions Path box. Um, the person at the card shop was like, hey, I got a Hidden Fates Elite Trainer box. Do you want it? Would you would you want one? I'm like sure. So then she's like, well, it's 170 some dollars. I'm like, no thanks. That's absurd. But I guess for what it is, it's why it's expensive. But I'm just afraid to spend that much on a box in real life. And I open it for a video, and like I don't get anything good. I mean, I, I probably if I hate I, I hate to say it, but like it, if I gr got big on YouTube, right, big enough to a point where to like. I wouldn't feel ashamed of getting a hundred seventy five dollar box to put out for you guys. Then I would get it. But for from your from my position right now, I, there's really no need for me to do that. But I'm just kind of glad to at least have ten packs on um, to get a hundred cards from Hidden Fates on the game. I guess it kind of makes up for it. So we're gonna go into a uh, Cosmic Eclipse. All right, give me a, give me an ADP. Give me an ADP. I'm I'm certain. I'm almost certain that this is the, the set it comes out of. I looked it up on TCG Player, and I'm certain this is the set it comes out of. All right, here we go. Swoobat. Not what I wanted. All right, we're, I think we're just going to continue going through these cosmic clips. We are 13 minutes in, and we're probably about halfway done. So, not bad timing. Zangus set up. Not a bad card. I think I have that in real life. Pig Knight, and then Blastophalon. Now, if you guys do want to see some more 100 pack openings, now, I actually do did enjoy grinding through these packs and like getting them to open up. So if you want to see more, make sure you like, make sure you comment. Let me know if I if you want me to go through them quicker, want me to go take take more take more like time more, or what, or how you how you want me to do them. If you want to see certain me open certain packs both in real life and in game, please let me know that as well. Now, if you do want to see some see me open, I've been considering getting more of these. I don't know why, but if you want to see me open some more some Yu-Gi-Oh boxes, let me know. I wouldn't be opposed to getting a Yu-Gi-Oh box. Right. Right, Bravo. And then if you guys, if you guys, let me know if you want me to read through all of the cards and show off everything I pulled. I mean, it shows on screen of everything, so. We got an Entei. I actually just bought an Entei today. It was a, it's an old one. Let me pull it, I'll pull up on the webcam, actually. Oh, uh, where's that? Where's that? Because I was just going through the binder and I'm like, oh. Or their their bulk box. I'm like, oh, Entei. This is an old Entei, but it's only it's, it was three dollars just because of the condition of it. So this is Aerodactyl I got. It's three bucks, but whatever. It's just a sort of binder. Like, it's it, it will help my Pokedex. Right. Next next pack of Cosmic Clips. Morale, Pikachu, Teddy Ursa, throw. 
Dartrix. Now there's a Dartrix card that I think it prevents damage from like a V or Oh, Mimikyu. That's that's an interesting art. I kinda wanna see how much that card's worth. So we're gonna pull up TCG player on the one screen. Hit the next I hope no, it had to have been. Oh my god, please tell me that was a pack that I can trade. I hope that was the one pack that I can trade. I'm happy that I pulled that to show on camera that I pulled that. Like, can I get a card like this in real life? Please, I want to pull a card like this in real life. And of course, you know, I pulled up game because that's how my luck goes. But yeah, let's check the value of it real quick. I just have to. So we're going to go TCG buy. Uh, what is this? Rush. Ram. I spell Rush. Ram. Rush. Ram. And Zekron. Is that the full art? I feel like that's the full art. No, that's not. Okay, it's the regular one. But the full art is $35. Holy cow. GX. Hey, that's a $10 card in real life. $5 card. I'll take it. I gotta check the other one, too. What's this one? Mimikyu? Mimikyu. I'm guessing it's a special. Nope, that's not it. Uh, not gonna show up on TCG? Okay, I guess it has no price. Oh, there it is. Secret. Thirteen bucks for that bad boy. Like, and I can almost tell you right now that it's only gonna be worth a pack in the game. This might be on, might be different, but that's only probably going to be worth a pack in the game. I've never seen anybody use it. It's a regular card. It's a regular attack. It's not a bad card. I mean, it might be worth more than a pack. That's disappointing, but also exciting at the same time. You got an Emboar. When you play this Pokemon Grand, you evolve one of your Pokemon to be turning into the top eight cards of your deck, attaching them to base damage. That's not a bad card. That's not bad for what it is. Nope, another. Let's keep going through this. Reverse Drillbur, Roller Skater, and Armaldo. I need one of those in real life. Can I have the card? Like, give me the card. Give me the real life card. Can I just look? Oh, man. Oh, man. Piplup. Hurtier. Okay. I, I was literally thinking in my head, I'm going to pull a secret out of that spot. That's, I, I like that art. I'm not going to lie to you. I like that Pikachu art. Crab, cr Crabominable. What? We got that though. Let's see what that's worth on TCG. Pikachu. Just so, oh, it's... Are you joking? Are Are you Market price $75 people are selling near mint $60 I mean if someone is willing to give me $60 I'll give you this card in the game like I, I honestly, I will, I would, I, I will trade you. Like, I give me a crappy card, and I will give me sixty dollars PayPal, and I will give you this. I will sell you any of these things I pull, because like this is, oh my goodness gracious. Yeah, that was all my packs that are not tradable. Oh wait, I couldn't even give it to anybody anyway, because it's not tradable. This game just tortures me. This game tortures me. It tortures me. Like. I understand why they make the not trade thing a thing, but that's, that's annoying. That's annoying. 
Alright, watch. We're gonna pull a secret. Nope, we get a reverse. Revile. While we're in revile, chaotic swell, and tight and all. I don't even understand like this. I don't I don't I don't understand this card. Like I so when I first played the I played Sun and Ultra Sun, I saw this and I'm like I, that's just weird. That's something that would come out of Yu Gi Oh. Open another one. Oh boy. Well we didn't get ADP, but we got we pulled over a hundred dollars worth of cards so far. Lone Sand Slash. But we still got packs left. We still got seven packs to go through at Cosmic Clips. And if yeah. So beyond it's oh, a cool it's cool. My girlfriend would like that. She's an Eevee Lucian fan. <laughs> Does Lord Ultra Beast? I got that card. <laughs> Next pack, here we go. Eevee, <laughs> why do I have hiccups? I'm like, geez Louise. Alright, secret. Nope. Delisle. And Does Lord. Alright, now they're slowing down. Armada, yeah, this like this. I think I think that's all my cosmic eclipse lock. Pikachu, secret. Nope. Reverse coming up. And a vol 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 Corona GX. I think it's only a couple dollars in her life. I don't think that's worth much. Um, I don't want I don't want it. I want to trade it. What's this for review? I don't know what that means. Open another. That is highly, highly disappointing to me. Like, I don't know. Rosa Hollow. Yeah. That's. I'm still. I'm still kind of salty, but not salty that I pulled those valuable cards in here. Because I knew it was gonna happen. Oh, interesting. Like that. Drompa. I might have to get some if I can find Cosmic Eclipse packs in her life. Because there's cards in here that I, that I need in my binder. And Wishy Washy Hollow. That's a weird looking Wishy Washy. The enemy opponent's turn if this Pokemon has any damage counters on it. Flip a coin of tails, shuffle this Pokemon, all cards attached into your deck. So it's bad. Alright, we got 22 Vivid Voltage, Champion's Path 21, 10 Human Fates. I think I'm just going to go on the Vivid Voltage and fly through these ones. All right, Nessa, boop boop. That's that's an interesting real word. And Shiftry, next one. Boom boom. Dustnar and Metagross. I need a Metagross in my life. Boop 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 boop. Boop boop boop. Try that. Reverse. Lichen Rock. I hate that Lichen Rock card. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I don't like it. I don't like. It. I like the other one. I like the other one better. Boop, 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 Nothing. I think I've been opening so many Vivid Voltage on here. Just because that's all you get out of the ladder. I'm pretty sure I have collected all the commons and rares out of this. Because it's not saying anything new for me. Fortress. I think I need that card too. Now, I can't remember why I got all these Sun and Moon bases for. Oh, Orbital V. is not the V card. I already have it though. Samurai. Open another. Charmeleon. It's always nice seeing Char. Another Leon. I literally just. I literally had. I should have kept it. Oh my. I had one. And I traded it for packs. So, because I, I don't know if I if I should like make my deck fancy or if I should just like get rid of them. But I do use them sometimes. But I'm like, if I can get the packs worth, I'll get rid of them. So we'll see. I'll, I gotta think about that one again. Because I do I do use Leon. So I'm like maybe I should just make my deck fancy. 
At least on this game, you got that fancy real life, just use the bomb cards. That's a Steelix V, and I'm pretty sure these effects are the, the abilities on here are turning into the Yu-Gi-Oh abilities, where they literally cover up the whole entire card. When you place Pokemon from your hand, evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may look at the top of your cards, your deck, attach any number of basic energy cards you find every Pokemon, any way you like, shuffle other cards go back into your deck. Oh, I am tired. It is only 8.30 at night, and I'm tired. I'm so old. Actually, I'm not that old. I'm only 22, but I feel old. Another Nessa Reverse. Memory Caps. Another Memory Capsule. I think I traded all my other way. That's like, that would have been my third one. That would have been my third Memory Capsule. Of gold. Third gold Memory Capsule. Like I said, a lot of the cards on here that I... Oh, another Charizard. I... Why can't I pull more of those in real life? I, I want more. I need another one of those. Dialga. That's a vivid voltage. Oh, I'm going to forget one of those. I didn't know Dialga was in every voltage because I do need Dialga for my binder. Pancho, Vaporeon. Six packs of vivid, vivid voltage left. Boop, boop, and... Oh. Oh, we got one new card. And reverse Scarbador and a Hollow Leon. Nice. I do like the Charizard Leon engine. I think it's a good a good engine. For Stroltic and Hollow Genesect. I need a, I need I think I need a Genesect in life. Oh, beauty ho beauty new. Shuffle reverse and Samurai regular. Next one. Reverse and oh, yeah, nothing good. I think the only like I don't even remember what's in this. Well, there's there's Pikachu obviously. Dreadnought. Right, this is the last of the voltage. Come on, give me a Pikachu. And nothing. What are we gonna pull? I don't remember what we pulled. That was decent. We, oh, we pulled the Pikachu, the Mimikyu, the Reshiram, the Zekrom. I think we pulled something else. That was good. I can't remember. Alright, we're gonna go into actually I kinda wanna go into Champions Path. We're gonna go into Champions Path. Now a lot of a lot of these Champions Path packs I got actually today. When I record I, I pulled them out whenever I recorded my uh, Champions Path box video. So that's what a lot of these packs are from. Some of them I traded for. Who I agree Oh yeah, shiny Charizard. Shiny Charizard. There we go, drop lock V. Can you tell that my phone? Speaking of where is it? Boop boop. Venusaur V. I did see that card in, in the uh, little stack. I thought I, I, I kind of thought about getting it, but I don't need it. It's only a dollar in real life. Alright. Boop, boop. Two Obstagoons. Reverse in the hollow. I would hate for that to happen to me. No, that hasn't happened yet. Our box in here. And, oh, that old. Oh, Rainbow Guard of our V Max. Let's go. How much is that going for? Door, the flower, V Max Secret. Twenty four dollars. This game feeds me. I did. Uh, I did, I did pull for what I pulled earlier. I need. Oh, that's, oh nothing. Huh. Ten dollars. Twelve dollars. Yeah, plus for twelve dollars. See what it tells. When I pulled out of the uh. Other thing, it's a steel engine, man. That looks, that looks fly. That looks pretty slick. At least these I can trade. So I can trade that guard of working next one on here, because I do not need it. A champ. Next pack. We're already at a half an hour recording. Oh my goodness. Potion. Off skip. Break. 
Lichen Rock. I did think about streaming some seven days tonight. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. I'm too tired. I kind of wait on. Zygarde got that. Pulled that card earlier today. Here's hot. Marnie Hollow. Freaking bitch. I hate that card. Because I move my mic around after all my mess. Hadron Hollow. Boop boop. Al Creamy V. That's an adorable little card, ain't it? Altaria Reverse. Boop boop. Scraggy and a Scrafty and a Machamp. I would love when we get to the Sin Fates, I wanna pull the shiny Lycan Rock. So bad. Zygarde. And Lycan Rock. I may have just have to make a whole page of them things. Incineroar V. I've faced up against that card a couple times. Or send my Lycan Rocks to get graded. I, I should do that. If you guys do want to see a graded video, let me know. I'll make a video of what I am getting graded and what I'm sending out. And then when it comes back in, I'll get, it comes back to me. I will uh, make the video of the return. Let's see what I get from them. See what the grades are. But let me know, let me know in the comments if you guys do want to see that. I know it does take a while for that. So and then to be personally, I thought I even thought about doing it on my own, and it just doesn't seem worth it to me. But if you guys want to see it, let me know. I'll definitely be more than happy to do it. I think it's the last champion's path. Come on, Charizard. Nope. All right. So we're gonna go in the Sun and Moon series. What can I even get out of these? I don't even know. What tag team? Can you, can you get tag team stuff in this? This one? Arcana? Oh, that's a cool Arcana art. I like that one. Two cannon. Crab Bumble. Crushing Hammer, Butterfree. I like that Butterfree rock. It's just a pack. Butterfree pack. Draw Z. Incineroar GX. Is that full art? No, it's not full art. I don't think it is. I don't think it's a full art. Boop boop. Target pack's hollow and reverse deuce it. I don't even know. I'm not even gonna try. Dragonair reverse and Clister. I like that reverse on that Dragonair. It's pretty cool with the dragon symbol. I never understood why they made the dragon um, specific Pokemon like that. I guess it is a type, but they don't even have like standard energies for it. I don't know. Metapod, Boulder, Drowsy, and Lone Muck. And we're seeing this for this guy's nobilities. Lantern. A bunch of new cards. I don't think I've opened a whole lot of Sun of Moon base on here. Deca Dewey. Is that what it's. Is that how. Deca Dewey? I don't know. Fomantis Spiro, Skarmory. Boop, boop. Oh, Umbreon GX. There we go. Pretty cool. I wish you could make a collection on here. Like, you have your, your inventory, right? And you can make a new category. And you can make the fill and like you mark cards and put them in this category. Solageo GX. This card runs you from this Pokemon, so some still strength. I put them with your bench Pokemon. Attach them to your bench. I might use this. Oh wait, I need a Cosmo. No, I don't have Rainbow energy. Another Umbreon. Holy cow. Another Umbreon GX. I wish I had these cards in real life, man. 
Kakarot. At least, again, I can trade them on these ones. I think I can trade away. So, get some more packs. Put them towards the next video. Gold Duck. Primer. Primer. Prim, 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 no, never mind. Primer Arena. Okay, sacked. Holy cow. Who knew 100 packs would be so draining? Alright, double color synergy. First one I saw, Chin Chow. Hey, there's a Cosmo. I'm sorry. Oh, Cosmo. Oh, so it goes Cosmog. Cosmo. Cosmo. Soligeo. Is that how that goes? I thought Soligeo was its own thing. It was a legendary, I thought. Dragonite. That's a new Dragonite, right? Pickle Volt. Dragonite. So that's what spoke about. I would hate to be t I, I, I don't, I, it, the, the coin flips in Pokemon is, I guess that's what makes the game, but, reverse Deku do I and Incineroar. Hariyama. We got 20 packs left. After this one. Genghis Khan, beware. Bone well, Sweet and Palo Sand. Oh, and Mock Reverse, another Beware. Oh, Deck Dewey GX. I do like how its wing is like a basically a bow. I think it's cool. If I did make a grass deck, I'm going to use that. Skarmory Reverse. Sarina? That's how you say it? Pardon me if I butcher all these, a lot of these names. Switch. That's a neat switch art. Mask Ren. Open another! The packs I ran from last video. Or empty packs. Drummel is, survey says, it's an error. Crab Amenable. Butchered that name, I know for certain I did. Two cannon. So we got no ADPs. We got lots of, we got a handful of good cards. Primer and a GX. We're getting a lot of GX and, and V cards. Didn't get the ADPs that I wanted to, but. And it kind of sucks that a lot of those cards that we pulled earlier, I can't trade them. They're locked to my inventory. That's annoying. All right, now we got to we got to the to the end, the end final ten packs and there are ten hidden fates. I have never opened a hidden fates pack in my life, so we're gonna see what we can get here. Come on, give me the shiny Lycan Rock GX. That's what I do want. Charmander, Clefairy. We got the shiny Espeon. I didn't even mean to click that first, but we got a shiny Espeon GX. That is sick. That is sick. How much is that art going? That how much is that going for? I just have to know. I just have to know what it's going for. GCG by SPRGX. Ninety five dollars. That card is worth. That card is worth ninety five dollars. That's tradable. If someone was giving ninety five dollars, I'll give you this card in the game. That's a tradable card. I'll give you oh man. Ninety five dollars for that. Oh my goodness. I can only imagine what a PSA ten is for. I can only imagine. Sabrina's suggestion? Electrode, no shiny. No shiny. And we got Shiny Viper. That's shiny, right? Is that shiny? I've never seen a, I've never seen a shiny Viper before, so I don't know. It must. Be, it has to be. All right. All right. Let's go. Shiny Lycanroc, but not the art I wanted. I oh man. 
I love. I, I I I do like it. How much is this one going for? How much is this one going for? Like in rock. Yes. Um, fifteen dollars. Okay. So we're well over a hundred dollars on cards we pulled out of this hidden fates. Maybe getting that freaking hidden fates trainer box might be might have been worth it. Who knows? Goes buys all three of them. That would be something. If now, if you guys want to see me go, go and try to buy all three of those trainer boxes, <laughs> gonna have to show some love and support for that. We got a Jesse James Hollow. Next one, for 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 Moza Hollow. That's not like the the black and the white. That's pretty cool. All right, we got three of them left after this one. All right, it's a Genghis Khan. Is that shiny? No, not shiny. Is it? No, I don't think so. And grab the reverse. God, I should I I should make try to make a uh, SB on deck. Shiny Charmander. Hey, look at that. We got a shiny Charmander. So that means there has to be a shiny Charizard in here. Last one. Weezing. Once per turn, this Pokemon is discarded with the effect of Jesse and James. You may have your opponent discard a card from your hand. I don't even think that was a shiny one. I think it was just a regular Weezing. Alright, last pack of the video. Pikachu. That's a new Pikachu. And it's a I'm speechless. I am genuinely speechless. Like I I I don't even know what to say. Or is it Moltres? Zapdos Arc Energy X. Please show me the just search more trays. It should come up. Price high to low. Oh, it's only fifteen dollars. But still, how much money? If I would have pulled these cards in real life, how much money do you think I would have had? How much money do you think in total? Did I? How much value did I pull out of all those packs? Let me know in the comments below because I'm not going to go back and add it up myself. Let me know because I'm intrigued. It has to have probably been $200. At least about $200 worth of cards I just pulled in game. That That's just... That, that's just... I'm speechless about it.